The big story today in Suffolk, the mini Olympics. The idea came from a PE teacher who wants to get Suffolk moving and get rid of childhood obesity. But only a select few made the cut to compete. Ten on your side, Stephanie Harris takes us to the game. Steph. Well, guys, each of the city's 13 elementary schools sent their best athletes, five girls and five boys, to represent. Now, despite the name Mini Olympics, this competition and the rewards are big. There's nothing better Let's go than a little friendly competition. Good hit! These people make it awesome. Yes. I you make can't it awesome. get any more sick than this. The first ever Suffolk Mini Olympics. I'm looking for Mac Ben's runner. Was his idea. It's about number one, making a memory for the children. Number two, promoting health and wellness. To get here, these athletes had to prove their prowess. Push ups, curl ups, the pacer run a flexibility test and a trunk lift test. And that was just the beginning. We had to like practice like every day of the week. But today they're the envy of their classmates. Those other kids wish they were here. They said, why am I not in it? And their role models. Some of the little kindergartners, they come past me and they say, can I hug you? I'm like, yeah, sure, why not? While many their age battle the bulge, they are an inspiration. We want to spotlight those athletes that are doing extremely well and then come up with another program for those that aspire to be athletes or that want to achieve and that want to compete. And while they'd all like to take one of these home. That's what she wants. That's her goal today. She wants her school to have a trophy. In the game of life. We want the sportsmanship trophy. These mini Olympians are already winning big. <laughs> They were great. And this just in, today's overall winner at the first ever Suffolk Mini Olympics, MacBen Elementary. Oh, the organizers from there, too. Is this fixed? No, I'm just kidding. They did great. The sportsmanship trophy went to Nansman Parkway, and the organizers say they could not have done this without the help of Lipton, who sponsored the whole event. Stephanie Harris, Ted on your side.